my name is Rachel, and I live in uh, Jamaica. I live in a natural healing center hidden in the hills seven miles from the Caribbean Sea. Uh, Spring Garden, Westmoreland, Jamaica. And I invite you to come up to the healing center and participate in any number of workshops that are offered up there. Massage, creative writing, dance, yoga, the five Tibetans. But most of all, the healing center heals you by virtue of being pure, pure mountain spring water, pure air, pure organic food right from the land, no noise pollution, no light pollution. So that's where I live. And I invite you, Spring Garden Healing Center. God bless. Okay, welcome my beloveds to um, the creative writing experience, 10 minutes at a time with Rachel Citrin. And uh, I welcome you. And I start out with telling you, um, giving you some warm ups. And the first warm up we do today is tapping. And our tapping is going to activate all the neurons in your body. There are millions of neurons in your body. And if you tap these neurons every day and say affirmations, you're going to change the programming that negatived your cellular structure in your body. So the, this warm-up is more beneficial than just for creative writing. It's an exercise that I do every day. And it goes like this, come and do it with me. I'm beautiful, I'm capable and lovable. And you say your own affirmation. I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. Third eye, I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. Over the eyebrow. I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. You can only use one hand, it's okay. And then the temple, I'm beautiful, I'm capable, and lovable. Say your own affirmation, or mine. I'm the happiest woman in the world. No matter what's happening, I'm the happiest woman in the world. Side of the nostrils. I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. Under the lips. I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. Say your own affirmation. You're reprogramming. And now here, I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. I'm poised, I'm elegant, and graceful. Breathe. Make sure you're breathing. Then the collarbone, I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. I'm down. I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. Down the sides, I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. I'm poised, I'm elegant, I'm graceful. Good, so what you did now was tapping. And if you're interested in tapping to reprogram the computer in your head that gives you negative thinking all the while, then check it out on YouTube with Sophia, Sonia Sophia, the, so the tapping goddess. Sonia Sophia, tapping goddess. I've been doing this now for three years. It really helps. And I have a driver in the grill, and I teach it to her as we're driving from my place in the hills down to the Caribbean Sea. And in the middle of it, I also introduce another thing, which I'll give it to you right now, which is I encourage you to incorporate into your life, which is, I'm beautiful, I'm capable, I'm lovable. No, I am wrong, yeah, noises. Come on, kids. No, 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 no. Releases toxins, it's breath work, and it also keeps you from ever having and it makes you laugh. Laughing is laughing's a healthy thing you can do for yourself. And if you do this every day, A-E-I-O-U, you'll never have to have a facelift. A-E-I-O-U. Don't you feel good? 
-hmm. It feels good. Okay, praise God, praise God. And um, now the creative writing, 10 minutes at a time. And uh, we start out with a prayer. Baruch HaTo Adonai Eloheinu Melech Elohim, Shehechienu Lehigianu Lehigianu Lazman Hazeh. Blessed art thou, Lord our God, King of the universe, who sanctified us by thy commandments and enabled us to live, to reach, to see this holy here and now moment when we gather together as the creative writings, writers of the universe. May the words of our mouth and the meditation of our hearts be acceptable unto thee. Praise God. And the rules are six rules. One, no thinking allowed here. Two, Keep your pen moving the entire time that you write. And if you can't think of anything more to say, what you say is, I can't think of anything more to say, and something more to say comes to you. Three, use specific details. God hides in the details. Four, forget everything they taught you in school. Five, we're free to write the worst junk in America. And six, you don't have to follow any of the rules. <laughs> and the first topic is having fun. <laughs> I'm first. Having fun. I'm having fun. And yesterday, a fun day with Nicholas and Jonathan, my handsome grandsons, came by. We went for dinner at Westport Plaza. Time's up. <laughs> Ten minutes at a time. Fun is exploring, meeting new people, having real conversations with people. It's fun, fun, funny, funny house. Are you having any fun? Happy, joyousness, happy are the people. God is the Lord. The joy of the Lord is my strength. How do I obtain this joy of the Lord? Is it earned? No. Then how, what, when, well, joy of the Lord. Having fun, walking outside, enjoying the sky, sunshine, watching, hearing, listening, loving the scenery, seeing clouds, moving clouds, shapes, sizes, colors, enjoying family get-togethers, listening to other stories. Getting tired, sleeping, working, teaching, playing. Congratulations, kids. Your first 10 minutes at a time writing session with your Aunt Lee. God bless. Thank you. Thank you, Aunt Lee. God bless. God bless. Promotion, promotion, promotion. I've also written a book, and my book is entitled 10 Minutes at a Time. You can purchase my book on Amazon.com. And uh, you can also email me. Uh, my Gmail address is included in the book. And I would really appreciate feedback on how you felt about the stories 10 minutes at a time. God bless, God bless, God bless.